For this Dollar Tree project, you will need one pack of these small wreath rings, four to six packs of cotton rope, zip ties, scissors, a hot glue gun, and non-toxic hot glue. To start, open your wreath rings and set one aside. And open one of your packs of rope. Cut off the zip tie holding it together. Starting at one of the crossbars, fasten the rope to the wreath form with the zip tie. Trim off the tail of the zip tie. Now you are going to wrap the rope around the wreath form. I found this easier to do if the majority of the rope was gathered together so I could pass it around the form easily. Start by wrapping over the tail and the zip tie, then continue around the form. Wrap tightly and make sure to push each wrap up against the previous one. When you get to the end of the rope, use another zip tie to fasten it to the center bar of the form. Then push through the ropes and pull tightly so you can cut off any of the tail that sticks out and the cut end will be underneath your ropes. Attach your next rope right over the previous one in the center of the wreath form. Then wrap it covering the tails of both the previous rope and the one you just added. Continue wrapping until your form is covered. When you get to the end, Attach a zip tie to the tail of your rope. Use this like a needle to feed the tail under the wraps of rope. And pull it out between two rope wraps. Adjust your tail as needed while doing this to get a nice tight final wrap. Use scissors to cut the rope tail as close as possible to your wraps without cutting them. Adjust your rope to hide the cut end. You're going to make two of these wrapped wreaths. You are going to attach them using a knot called a wrapped knot. This is a macrame knot and my absolute favorite way to fasten things together for my rats.
After you have the knot positioned how you like, use some hot glue to seal the ends into place and prevent them from pulling out. You can also take this time to hot glue any spots on your reeds that you didn't feel sat quite right or might slide a little bit. To hang this toy, you have a few options. My favorite way to hang things like this is with plastic shower rings, also Dollar Tree purchases, and lanyard hooks. You open the ring, put this around the wreath, and then you put the hook on the small peg that fastens the ring closed. Repeat this on the other side. You can add one hook on each side for a more wobbly, challenging climbing toy, or use four to make it more secure. An alternative way to hang the toy is to make loops with extra cotton rope. Loop these around the wreath instead, and then fasten those to the cage with lanyard clips, C-clips for birds, or zip ties. If you have a bunch of t-shirts, you could use t-shirt yarn, or even braid strips together and use those in place of ropes. You could also use strips of fleece if that's something you have on hand instead. You could also dye the cotton rope with fabric dye before wrapping for a custom toy that matches your decor. This toy is great for rats who love to climb and balance on things, like my little dwarf guys. I hope your rats enjoy. Thanks for watching. Bye!